So, let's jump to the present. Right, OK. Three major sellout UK tours. Platinum selling DVDs. Right. I'm fucking loaded. All right. <laughs> Absolutely caked up beyond belief. It's shocking. <laughs> now I'm fine with it. It's fantastic. It's fucking lovely. The management are a little bit spooked. They worry about these things. The management. They called me in. They said, Mick, Mick, look. You're from the people. You're of the people. You're one of the people. But if they find out how much money you've got, they could go right on the turn. I said, look, don't worry, I'll talk to them about it. <laughs> then they really started panicking. <laughs> so this is what I've come up with, people. For the next couple of hours, you've got to imagine I am still like you. <laughs> but with money. All right. <laughs> and we'll all get along fine. I ain't got to keep bullshitting ya. Things like, I, I was on the train the other day. <laughs> I wasn't on the train the other day, all right? I'm in the back of a Mercedes Benz. <laughs> Tinted windows, champagne and ice. <laughs> anyway, the East End has changed. So I'm in Tesco's. I'm watching stuff unfold. So this woman talking to her children, she said, Hector, unity. What pasta do you want for your evening meal? The kids are on it like a shot. Tell her, tell her, mother. <laughs> With the carbon on doors. <laughs> She's a good choice, children. Very, very, very good choice. Positive reinforcement is cool. I know that now. I drifted back to when I was a little boy, me having the same conversation with my mother. No, you can't have alphabet spaghetti again. <laughs> I wouldn't mind, you can't even spell, you thick little fucker. <laughs> As you can imagine, I stay in nice hotels. <laughs> Ooh, proper, what they call over-service. They follow you around, I have to say to them, will you fuck off? <laughs> well, they eat these sausages. Bit harsh, but <laughs> you know that they drive you mad. Anyway, nah, I may be a bit of a cockney Herbert, but I've, met, I've got a wife. She's a proper person. She's got proper friends, and they come round for the evening. We sit around, we dip bread in oil. <laughs> oh. You've got to treat yourself, ain't you? When did that happen? When did the oil become a treat? It used to be for the chips. <laughs> for an egg sandwich. Oh, son, it's on the table. <laughs> it's got to be proper oil. You can't be putting fries, crisp and dry out or <laughs> Mazzola. It's got to be extra virgin. <laughs> it's got to be oil that ain't been fucked. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm rehearsed, I'm ready. I go downstairs. I'm walking around the island. This is not really big enough, to be honest with you, but I'll have to do for now, right? I'm walking around the island. Walking around the island. The dog's following me. The dog thinks it's his walk. <laughs> Let's just say... We've got off to a bit of a shaky start. Let's have another bruschetta. That's a disappointment, I know, isn't it? The bruschetta. <laughs> I ordered one the other day. It's a bruschetta, mate. Oh, my friend, it's a bruschetta. <laughs> I said, it's eight and a half quid for tomato on toast. Now, fucking go and <laughs> Now, you younger men have probably got girlfriends who will stay up quite late, 11 o'clock, things like that, you know, like three episodes. You're going to get married and have children. She's going to go back to work. You're going to get a lot of this. About half eight, you get, oh, I've got to go to bed, babe. I'm absolutely shattered. You must never say at that point, why is that then? <laughs> why are you so tired, babe? 
you have to go, oh, I can imagine, babe. Oh. The day you've had, eh? <laughs> you had let the gardeners in, didn't you? <laughs> Put that Ocado delivery away. <laughs> Show the cleaner where she's going wrong. I'll bet you're in bits, babe. Now, I know then, when I mentioned having a cleaner, I lost a lot of you. Because you're like, oh, I'll see. Claim you're one of us, but you've got a cleaner, have you? <laughs> now, I found it hard getting a cleaner. I've had sisters who were cleaners. It's hard, isn't it? But, and I thought it. I didn't want to become part of the petty bourgeoisie. <laughs> but then the house got a bit too big, to be honest with you. We, we, we couldn't cope. I mean, she was struggling with the West Wing, you know. <laughs> East Wing was a state. I said, all right, we'll get a cleaner. OK. So we went and got a cleaner. She's a lovely lady. Uh, I have to tell you at this point, she's from abroad, all right? She's from abroad. We're not quite sure where. We don't pry. <laughs> she likes to come on a Friday, right? My wife makes herself scarce on a Friday, leaving me to deal with the cleaner, right? Every Friday I get this, okay. So she comes in, I make her a nice cup of coffee and I go back in the kitchen on the laptop. She likes to start upstairs. Then I get this all of a sudden, she's by the kitchen door. America, America. You know what cafe for the shit out I've got one shot at this. I'm going to start to sound like a racist because I keep saying, what, what, sorry, what, what? I turn to go, work up a bottle of shale bar. <laughs> she say to yeesh. <laughs> then I have to pretend I'm thinking about it. Work up a bottle of shale bar. Work up a bottle of bar. Work up a bottle of shale bar. Work up a bottle of bar. Work up a bottle of bar. Work up a bottle of bar. Work up a pot a healer bar, work up a pot a healer bar. <laughs> Where the cafe put the silly bag? Yes! <laughs> Yay! Work up a pot a healer bar! <laughs> so it's in the bathroom cabinet, top right hand side. <laughs> Child was created. He's a lovely little boy. And to give him a future, we went and bought a house in a nice area. Ooh. Now, you know what a nice area is. You know if you live in a nice area, because you have a few delicatessens. <laughs> and these places have no relationship to reality whatsoever. They make the prices up in the morning. <laughs> Sebastian, I've got four artichokes over here. Any ideas? Are they organic? Yes. Mm. 30 pounds, 30 pounds. <laughs> My wife goes in them. She came home the other day with a loaf of bread for a fiver. She put it down. She said, I bought that loaf of bread, it was a fiver. I said, oh, we're paying a fiver for a loaf now, are we? <laughs> she said, oh, you don't understand what it's got in it. <laughs> I said, it better be a two pound coin. <laughs> One of her favourite things is to go to a West Wall. <laughs> she loves the West Wall. She's very middle class. She loves the West Wall. She says, can we go to a West Wall? And I say, of course we can. <laughs> and we go to the West Wall. And she says, isn't it a lovely ambiance? <laughs> and I say to her, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> I've worked out what an ambiance is. It's a night out without poor people. <laughs> it's the people with a few quid saying, can we just have one night without the poor people turning up? You know what they're like, they'll be banging a couple of spoons together, singing my man's a dustman, creating an atmosphere. You know they love an atmosphere, Russ Abbott said it. I'm trying to enjoy the ambiance, but it's somewhat small for me. I've noticed there's no tomato sauce on the table. My wife looked at me, she said, you're going to ask for tomato sauce, aren't you? I said, of course I am. I'm having the risotto. <laughs> Can't eat risotto without red sauce, it's too dry. <laughs> Don't 
dangerous. It's a health and safety issue. You've got to zhuzh it up, as Jamie says, zhuzh it up. Bit of red sauce. So I said to the waitress, excuse me, have you got any ketchup in the building? She looked at me like I'm the biggest pleb who's ever walked in that restaurant. <laughs> she walked off, she came back with what she'd rustled up. Pot about that big, two chipfuls of tomatoes. <laughs> she tried to put it down and walk away like she's doing a drug deal. <laughs> Stop, I said, oh, don't rush off, love that. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> and I took a sip of it. <laughs> and I looked her in the eye. I said, yes, I'll have a bottle, please. <laughs> Where you are. <laughs>